Welcome, welcome everyone. I hope you're all having a fantastic day. I'm having a pretty darn good one. So, we're fully up into the new Gibble rework and all the S Plus stuff that's been added. And everything has changed. And it's kind of defeated what we were doing here with the payment tree, but it's okay. We've talked about it before. And we're going to progress on with the taming pretty much the rest of the stuff we've got to tame, which we're getting close to having everything tamed, y'all. Like, we, we've literally only got a handful of critters left. Uh, like, for reals. And I'm even going to, I'm still going to give what they needed to be used or tamed before the update, just because, you know, completion's sake. Uh, supposedly it still works, so, I mean, I don't know. Maybe it's something we'll have to test at some point. And, uh, I, if y'all can see, as I've done a little bit of changes, there are now gates and places that were not gates. I have, I have had a day, y'all. Like, I have, I have had a day. I have had an accidental J whistle where everything followed me, and I mean everything inside and outside the base over here in the corner then i had a kitty cat step on a keyboard and do the exact same thing after i had sorted everybody out and for some reason i am having this weird <laughs> i don't even have an explanation for it um my spinals here my stego and one of the turtles which they're all those are all on passive those aren't but i've all been running over here standing look right here I don't know why. I can't figure it out. Even this dude comes, comes over. He literally stops. Like right here. Everybody just stands here. And stares at this floor. I don't know what's going on. It's very weird. <laughs> I may have to put down some uh, some uh, uh, fence posts. Or something. I don't know what's going on. It's very strange. I just thought I'd share that in case all of a sudden everything decides to go running while we're doing our thing. That way y'all know what's going on. <laughs> but today. 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 We are going to go after one of... My, it's, I guess you could say it's one of my favorite creatures. I don't know, there's only, there's a reason why I like it. And I'll actually explain that while, once we get it. And that is the Megatherium. And, uh, these bad boys, y'all, these bad boys, they are crazy. Uh, they're, I don't know, it's been a while since I've really tamed one and played with one. So I don't think they've changed, but they're, they're pretty strong. They're somewhat useful. I mean, they're not like, you know, must-haves. Matter of fact, if, honestly, if you're just going to be taming creatures from now on that you want for PvP with the devil tame, you're probably not even going to bother with them. Anymore. But that's okay. They're a very interesting creature, y'all. Very interesting. I think it might be getting foggy. Uh, first and foremost, let's work on our kibble. So, the... Boop. Megatherium takes superior kibble. Now, that is with a large egg. That means Allosaur, Argentavis, Manthus, Maglania, Mag Maglosaurus, Moss Chops, Snow Owl, Spinosaurus, Tapihara, Titan Boa. Alright, so before we even go over there, we're going to need to grab some stuff. Uh, and I'm pretty sure we have it, unless I just goof it all up. I need prime meat jerky. Uh, prime meat jerky. We're going to need, for a max level, at 2.5 single, we're going to need 13, so let's grab ooh, close to that. Let's, let's put some back. I didn't mean to do that. Stack that back. Let's put some back. Okay. We got 13. Alrighty. Um, we're also going to need raw mutton. Ooh, that we may have just run into our Achilles heel. Uh, do I have any mutton? I do indeed have a bunch of raw mutton. Fantastic. I was afraid we didn't have that. These new kibble combinations, y'all, these are quite interesting. Giant bee honey, which we've got tons of that. Now, it's go no, wait, I am looking at the wrong thing. Well, wow, completely ignore me. Reset, rewind. Uh, didn't happen. <laughs> okay, I was looking at what the magnetarium needed to paint. Because I'm having one of them days, y'all. It's one of them days. One of them days. Okay, reset. Large egg, we went over those. Prime meat jerky. Citronol, two. Per kibble. Sap. Uh, I know we have sap somewhere. There's a mess still in here. I need to straighten all these little dinos up. It, 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 it was a mess, y'all. Alright, so we need sap. Doot, doot. Okay. We need two raw mushrooms per. So let's grab. Uh, what? So I'm making 13, so I need 26. Okay. Man, that was too many. And. Oh, no, that was way too many. <laughs> Stop doing that, please. <laughs> Boop. 
<laughs> that, that's fine. You know what? That, that's perfectly fine. I don't care. And then we're gonna need five fiber part. So let's go over here. And instead of just carrying the eggs, I've decided we're just going to start doing the whole pull the eggs because why not? It does not matter what eggs it pulls now as long as it pulls the eggs we need. So let's see. We need superior kibble. So superior kibble. Da -da. Crafted foods. This is augmented. This is the one we want right here. Once again, that is two citronol. One large dino egg per. That's Allosaur, Argentavis, Mantis, Magnolia, Maglosaurus, Moshtop, Snow Owl, Spinosaurus, Tapihara, and Titan Bow. I really don't understand why the Moshtops. I may want to check that. That don't seem correct to me. I'm using Dodo X's information, so if it's wrong, blame Dodo X. <laughs> <laughs> It's usually fairly up to date, but you know how I do. All right, so boom, uh, pulled resources thirty nine. So let's see what type of exit pull. We pulled. Oh, why did you do that for? Let me back up. We pulled nine. Wait, what? Nine Argentava, right? And two Spina. Hmm. Yeah. Okay. So you know what? I'm going to double check this while we make this because that is not matching the information we have on our dodo decks so lessons are being learned with this kibble rework y'all i know we've made a video on it before and there was some odd like things have changed and i, I it's super annoying because they give us the information but everyone seems to be sharing the wrong information like i i don't know all right so let's look at the wiki to see what the wiki says the wiki says superior is allosaur Argentavis, Mantis, Magania, Magosaurus, Moss Chops, Snow Owl, Spino, Topihar, and Titan Bow. So it's basically the same information. But why wasn't this list in Spino before? I'm super confused by that. Hmm. Was it? No, just, no it's not listed in Spino. Oh, it is listed. Wow. I apologize, y'all. I'm really having a date. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Anyways, I, I have no excuse for myself. <sighs> okay, uh, let's see. Let's go grab the Quetzal. Because even though we could. I don't know if we're going to tame this guy out in the wild or we're going to tame him back at base. I could get a pencil when we get there. Hey, Bat. Alright, so. These dudes can be found. Mostly in the snow. <laughs> I don't know. I don't think they spawn anywhere else, honestly. And uh, just in case you're actually wondering, the Magnetherium is actually a type of giant ground sloth, uh, which is really cool because there's a good chance we actually ate these bad boys as early man. Um, oh, look at that. That is a, what? Is that white, black, and green? He is. That is an odd combo. I love it. 25? Ew. You're just a baby, Brano. Alright, so. Over here, somewhere, I'm sure we'll find one. If they haven't been ate by the aloes. And the Utes. The Utes, like, I'm going to eat you, kitty cat. <laughs> I'm scared of the thing so bad, yo. Uh, look, there's one right there. Do, do, do. Look at you. Dude, oh, wow. Alright, that is a level 50. We want much higher than that. We are not accepting anything below 100 on this bad boy today. Because why not? Uh, let's see, let's look. Anyways, oh, there's another one. Okay, that is a level 25. You see any more here? Boom. Level 90. Oh, we're getting closer. Let's see, that's a Deo Dawn. Oh, what's that? Oh, the wolf. We're getting closer there. We found a level 90. That's not bad. I mean, we might, under extreme circumstances, we might accept that. I don't know. I would rather not. And I've got to apologize. It is storming like crazy outside in case y'all hear the crazy wind blowing. Again, one of them days, y'all. One of them days. Ooh, aren't you? Kind of crazy looking. It's so strange. Uh, where did we see that level 90 yet? Someone's here. Oh well, we'll find another. 
But, uh, let's see. Giant Grand Sloss, yes. Um, the species in art, sorry, apologize, like I said, it's still only quite bad outside. <laughs> wow. Um, <laughs> the species in arc is most common relation would probably be the one that was found in South America only. Um, they were quite large, uh, 20 feet or so. Uh, let's see. What do we got there? That's Colicotheriums. Um, they were one of the largest. Oop, right there we go. Quick, get it. Bam! Oh, he's even a good color. Fantastic. <laughs> look at you, look at you. Look at you. Woo, yeah, giant ground sloth for the win. Let's take this back to base, because that was a bad place. Y'all see all that? Goodness gracious. Um, let's see what else. They were quite large, like I said. Yeah, they were one of the largest land mammals. Um, we probably ate them. Uh, what else is there to know? Um... Oddly enough, some species of giant ground sloth, not maybe not necessarily this one, had little armor platings. Uh, now I don't know if they were on the fur or under the fur. Like I, that's something I'm not entirely sure on. Uh, that protected them from predators, like kind of like an armadillo did. But it, like it's really strange. Um, it's really fascinating. <laughs> Let's see what else is nice to know about those. Hello, Pterodon. He's kind of scared me. I'm not going to lie. You freak me out a little bit. Uh, Magnetherium means... Well, it actually... I think it means multiple things. Uh, it's either great beast, giant animal, uh, large animal, basically big critter. <laughs> now, like I said, I'm not entirely sure about the one in Ark. And we know most of the stuff in Ark is a little... Not exactly what the, you know... The names are kind of made up and they're, they're all fake and, like... Yeah. So let's knock this bad boy out. Uh, we want this one. And because it's getting foggy, let's turn the generator on so our lights are on so it's nice and lit up. Some stomp, stomp. Are you going to behave yourself? Okay. Jeez, you're big. Ugh, don't hit me. Please don't hit me. Are you not going to hit me? Okay, that's good. You can beat up on the house. I don't care about beating up on the house. Just don't break it. And the down all right let's do this so as we were saying earlier taming food um superior kibble um they used to eat as their primary kibble before the change magna magnalenia which i believe is the the komodo dragon looking lizard that can climb on walls and stuff and since this dude's going to take about 40 minutes to tame normally i'm going to throw one of these into it we're going to wait for just a second, and we're going to go over the other foods real quick that he can eat. They, uh, superior kibble, or magnolania, depends on if it still eats it. Raw mutton, giant honey, cooked lamb chop, raw prime meat, cooked prime meat, and then, of course, raw prime fish meat, and then so forth down the list, including mato berries. They do both. Even though we believe in true form in the wild, this guy was actually an herbivore. It, ooh. It looks like he may need more than that, don't it? Alright, he's at 50%. I think we're good. I think we're good. He, he might. Let me out. Let's go quick, quick. Get some meat. Get some meat. Okay, I guess we're good. <laughs> well, that we were, we were panicking for no reason. Let me in. Jeez. Let's put this way. Right, Having days. Having one of them days. I know you can get through that. Come on. Come on. Really? There you go. Oh, oh, oh. No, get off of me. Okay. You stay there. Go get the quetzal put up. Let's get a saddle. Wow. Now, what are these guys' uses? Other than, personally, I, I, y'all go see. There's a reason. Y'all see that? Oh, somebody was fighting. That's impossible. Well, that's weird. Well, that's weird. That was weird. All right, so let's make a saddle. All right. Uh, mega therium. Uh, mega therium saddle. Level fifty-two requires one hundred smithing paste, one hundred thirty fiber, three hundred twenty-five hide, fifty-five metal ingots, and it is made in the smithy. 
Dude, dude, dude. Uh, do I have? Do I have multiples? Uh, Mega Rosserus, Mega Ethereum. I don't think I have another one now. Um, let's just to be sure. Type the extra letters. Oh look, I do have an extra one. Mega Ethereum inside. I think I just might have just got that. Well, let's put that on there for him. Let's make him have a nice set. Why not? Let's welcome, welcome. I think her to the family with, you know, something special, some nice blink. <laughs> now, utilities. Um, these dudes are tanks, y'all. Straight up, like, uh, they have normally very high uh, hit points, which is not their main main purpose. Completely honest, they are bug bug eaters in this game. Like, they are all about smashing them bugs, y'all. They collect chitin as the primary harvest resource. Uh, oh, look, you had a kibble left. Aren't you special? Um, look at you. Aren't you just glorious? You're like a giant, like, monster horse thing. Like, I don't know. Like, I don't even know what to think. Anyways, let me get you a big belt. That's so strange. Uh, let's look at the stats real quick before we go any farther. Ah, 6,512.3 health, 1,680 stamina. 945 oxygen, 10,800 food, 1,189 weight. That's not bad. 384.2% melee damage and 100 movement speed. And it is a level 209. Look at it. Isn't it glorious? I love them. Now, why I like these guys, and we're going to talk on the, the, the whole chit and gathering stuff here, man. I'm going, to, I'm going to show you all why I like these guys. And it's stupid. I'm going to be completely honest. And yes, we're coming over here to the tree because this is part of it. <laughs> Y'all ready for this? Y'all ready for this? Sit down. That. That alone. That right there. I don't know why. They make me feel like it's like some sort of Buddha thing going on. I, I, I can't explain it. I love it. For some reason, that just... You know how one of them weird ones? Yeah. I'm weird. I know. <laughs> Stand up. Alright. Anyways. These guys, y'all. I would attack this turtle and show you the clutch it, but you know, even though everything here is supposed to be on passive, I have learned my lesson today. I know better. Nothing over here is going to be on passive if I hit something. <laughs> so we're going to run up over in here, away from all the dinos. But we know there's going to be some bugs. There's always bugs over here. We can our, our trusty, uh, hidden, what you call it, uh, blah, 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 oasis. Is always good. It, it, it seems to supply a lot of the stuff we need when we need it. So we're gonna go over here and get us some bugs, and we're gonna see just how much chit this dude does collect off of her bug. And of course, we're gonna get over here. There's probably not gonna be any bugs whatsoever. It's like gonna be like a giant alpha rex or something that's just gonna wreck our face. We're stuck in a rock. Come on, you can do it. You got this. Ooh, angry chicken, angry chicken. Turn, turn. Ooh, look at that bird over there. Okay, let's stop. Oh, there's no, let's not stop. There's a lot of dillos here. Let's keep going. Let's get our feet wet. Oh, there's a car now. Jeez. I'm just it's over there. We're just running through for a moment. We'll come deal with you in a minute. Okay, okay. Aha. So, <laughs> we got left click. Yarr. Right click. Bite. Can we do this from this angle? We can't. Okay, anyway, that's better. Left click. Right click. Oh, what is he doing? Is that kid in the ground? I thought he was biting. Oh, I think he might be hitting the ground. No C. Okay. Uh, these dudes collect. Thatching. Ooh, whoa, 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 whoa. Am I? Okay, I'm not. They collect thatching wood. Uh, as you can see. They collect berries, but their primary is chit. And I was really hoping we'd have some bugs over here before we actually had to fight anything. Um, I want to test, though, before we go and play battle. I want to see... Gosh, you look gorgeous. Yeah. Totally agree. I want to see... I don't want to break down these pretty trees. Why do I like trees so much? Okay, we're going to hit this one. Alright, so... Uh, 177 thatch. 120 thatch. So it seems like right click might get more thatch. Maybe. 
Try that again. Eh, about the same. But it does appear that. Okay, left click does harvest. Okay, so. Hmm, it was weird. We just weren't getting them before. Oh, I killed a Hesperornis. Oops. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so can we can we aggro some bugs over here, y'all? Like, where's the bugs at? There's always bugs over here. It's 122 with the left click. Let me bite your butt. Go bite it. Bring it here. Oh. Ooh, 362. What? I don't know why we did that much, but dang. Well. All right, so let's double check. 188 with right click. <laughs> I'm gonna fight a Carno next. I know you, you you're fast, but you're not. That's fine. We'll hit you. So 122 with that one. All right, so let's level up one. Level up uh, melee from 384.2 to 3899. Not bad. <laughs> Elbow chop. chop. <laughs> so we picked up, or looks like we picked up five points on the left click. What did you fight? Dilla, what? Alright, so yeah, wow, look. We did a lot of that on the right click. He does harvest meat. That's what I wanted to check. Now, does he harvest meat with the other attack? He does. But not so well. Not as much. Where are the bugs at? Why are there no bugs? Let's go check over here. I bet there's bugs over here. We all want to go. Actually, before we do any more, let's check. Uh, his health goes from 650. Oh, that is a lot on the health meter, y'all. How about movement speed? Only one. That's there he is. He's all like, praise be. <laughs> I love it. Oh, shut up. Nobody wants to talk to you. All right, game up so we can see in the shades. Here, buggy, 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 buggy. Let's hit this. Let's get some bugs. Any bugs? Oh, we poop. No, where are the bugs at? See, see, Arc likes to do that, y'all. You want something? Normally, they're all over the place. If they're mass pain in the butt, there ain't nothing you can do about it, and none. And then when you want them, it's like where y'all is. Hello, where are you? Well, are we angry with somebody up there? No, okay. He's like, I don't want to hate that to kick some. Uh, Look, old butt. Ooh, look at that trike. And a trodon. Ah. 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 Dead trodon. Ah. Ah. Don't be naked. That's what I thought, punk. Ah. Ah. Let's get that other trodon. Ah. Ah. Yay! That's what we wanted right there, was level up. That is hoping we find some bugs. But I guess we're not going to get lucky enough to find bugs. This guy's too slow to really run too far looking for bugs. But I was hoping. But I think we are going to wrap it up there, because we have kind of come up on that time. And I don't want to go too far over, you know, you know. So I hope y'all enjoyed today's episode. I know, it was, it was a little crazy. Like, y'all, it's been one of them days. I'm not going to lie. It has been a day. <laughs> Let's kill a turtle before we go. See how the chitin does on that turtle. Ah, turtle's like, ow! Chit for him. Because he's got a shell. I want to eat it. I want to eat it. Ah. Ready? 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 Ah. Eh, it's only eight here. Eh, okay, it's probably better on bugs. Um, oh, and, and, and. He does get a buff when fighting bugs. That's one of the reasons I wanted to find bugs. Um. When you kill a bug, he that's one of the reasons why they're, they're, they're actually really good. Um, brain fart. Uh, 
they get this thing. I think it's, I think it actually is called Bug Killer. I was hoping we'd be able to show it. What bugs? Where are the bugs at? Why is there no bugs around when you want them? Put the dodo. No bugs? Of course, there's no bugs. Why are there no bugs? It's very aggravating. Ooh, let's see. Who's that? <laughs> you suck. <laughs> well, uh. Anyways, when you kill a bug, they get a buff. And, uh. It, it, it's very useful, in particular, when fighting the Broodmother. Um, like, extremely so when fighting the Broodmother. Because she drops all the spiders down so that, you know, you kill one spider and you basically get this buff, and then the rest of the match, you're doing extra damage and you're kicking butt and, and literally taking spider names, and yeah. And you're probably going to be overweight with uh, chitin before it's done with. Because, you know, this dude collects a lot of chitin off of bugs. He really does. <laughs> It's great for cementing based. I really wish we'd find a bug. Where are they at? Like, there's no more bugs everywhere, y'all. Ooh, you gotcha. I still don't know why those are around. You gonna get stuck on a tree, son? Kitty. Bugs? Bugs? Here, bugs. Ah, we found bugs. Alright, so. Y'all watch as soon as I can hit one of these. Alright, so up here in the corner. Insect killer, that's what it's called. Alright, so. Let's see if we can find something to smack before this wears off. And we'll see just how much more damage we're doing. Of course, this everything is like hiding beside the doe head, but we don't want to smack because he's armored and it does no damage. <laughs> Why are we having one of these days? What attack the doe head to make the doe head ball up that I can't find? Ooh, raptors. That works. Come get some. Ugh. So see, look, we are doing a lot more damage, y'all. Like, a lot more damage. Arr. See, how much chitin did we get off of two bugs? Look at that. 68 chitin off of two bugs, y'all. Two bugs. Dude, this is great at collecting chitin. Fantastic. But we're going to go ahead and wrap it up there, because... We've gone a little bit longer than I intended to go anyways, and there's not much more to really talk about this guy. They were the biggest land animals. They they played bugs really well. I mean, yeah. Good chance early man ate them. Well, not known for positive, but it's it, it's most likely known. <laughs> and, we, and we got the stinky, stinky aromas. But I hope you all enjoyed today's episode. If you did, you want to show your support, smack that thumbs up button. Comment below, let me know what you thought. If you got any questions, suggestions, tips, or anything you want to see, if you just want to say hi, subscribe if you haven't already. Share this if you would so this find it easier, helps me out, helps me out. And it's an amazing thing to do. Remember, y'all, stay safe. Oop, wrong button. Have fun. And art is life.